Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 17th of February 2024. I hope you are keeping well. This is my Sudoku at bedtime. It's a Saturday evening here. Oh dear, this day has already gone. My favourite day of the week. It's gone already. Never mind. Life marches on. Nothing we can do about it. Uh, what's going on in the news? I see that large technology companies... Uh, like Adobe, Microsoft, um, who else? IBM, uh, TikTok, and a couple of others are signing an agreement whereby they are trying, going to try to limit the dangerous aspects of AI on the uh, up and coming elections. Now, I'm not sure if that only means the US election. They're all US companies, of course. Well, TikTok is not. Uh, but. They all have, uh, you know, their main market, I suppose, is the US. But this year we have lots of elections everywhere. India, uh, Indonesia, I think has already finished theirs. But um, uh, the UK and other places too. Huge amounts of elections everywhere. So let's hope that they uh, take other countries seriously too. Uh, but also let's hope that they don't try. The trouble is that the technology that they often use for screening these things takes out stuff that is satirical humorous stuff like that you know like i've seen people complaining on uh, youtube chat on youtube where they, they've had videos removed because they think they are promoting some conspiracy theory or something in fact they're they're not they're taking them <laughs> they are um satirizing it i was gonna say something bad there um uh, you know, it's uh, not as it appears. And sometimes there are, you know, people talking about COVID-19 uh, who are trying to point out the idiocy of the conspiracy theorists, but they get labeled as a conspiracy theorist themselves, you know, by pointing out what is going on. So let's hope they can, uh, if they're, they're supposedly art talking about artificial intelligence, how about using some artificial intelligence on the screening itself? Anyway, we shall wait and see. Let's get on with the game of Sudoku as supplied by the Los Angeles Times here. We've got sevens blocking a la blue lines. And that's going to put seven into that square there. We're going to end up with sevens in those squares, I see. Like that very symmetrical kind of um, pattern going forward. <clears throat> Okay, we have four across here and here, and a four down there. Well, again, I don't know what it means, but I do see 2, 6, and 8 blocking this square here. So it's got to mean 2, 6, and 8 are in those squares there. We do need 2, 6, and 8 in this row. Am I right? Yes, I am right. So then that is going to be a 7. I guess I could have just said 7 blocking there and 7 blocking those squares. That would have been an easy way of doing it. Now we've got 8s over here now. Uh, what about the twos and the sixes? Sixes down there. Twos, I don't know. But we do have two and eight down here, so that's two and eight. So this has to be three and nine. So we have three and nine blocking up here, and we have three and nine blocking across here. So we've got a pair of three and nine here which is going to put 3 and 9 into those squares. 3 and 9, 3, 9, and we've got 9 blocking there. So there's our 9 and there's our 3. That's a nice start. We've got 3 across here, 3 up here, and 3 up there, giving us a 3 in that square. So 
six blocking all the way up there puts the six into that square so for one of our missing digits here blocking down here four up there four across there there's our four Uh, I can get this, what did I say, 2 and 8 block down here, so that's 2 and 8, I've forgotten what this is, oh, I know it was only a short time ago, it's 3, 9, wasn't it, okay, so this then is going to be our 5, Seven across here and seven down there will give us seven in that square. Eight blocking down here puts eight into one of these two squares, blocking across eight down here. There's our eight. And I said before the two blocking down will give us two there. Two up here means this is two. Uh, we know this was 3 and 9 in those squares, and we had 3 and 9 blocking there, so that's our 1 now. Uh, I see 825 going across there, that's a triple, so 825 must be in these squares here. Uh, right, 825, okay, so in these squares we don't want 825, we want 134. And we've got 4 blocking here and 4 blocking there, so that's our 4. We'll be left with 1 and 3 in those squares there. Now I can see we've got ones blocking across like this, so that's going to put ones in those squares. So we've got ones there like that, which means ones have to be in one of these two squares in the middle, and we clearly can't have a one there, so that is going to be our digit one. Uh, one across here, one across there, one up there. There's our one. And one up to the top gives us a one in that square there. No, something's wrong. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I was having a panic. I was panicking there. I thought something was clearly wrong, but no, I'm okay. I think I might just wander through the digits and see if I can spot anything useful. Um, no, I only knew that three.
Okay, so we've got three blocking this square, three blocking this square, and three blocking this square. So in this column, that's where the three is. And now three black, black back that way, there's our three. And this is our nine. nine blocking this square and this square and this square so in this column there's our nine Uh, I was going to go through the digits before I stopped. I'm going to start again. don't have any completed digits here, I just noticed. So we have 6 and 9 across here, 6 and 9 across here, so that's a pair of 6 and 9. Uh, no help on from down here. But now we've got 7 blocking across there and 7 up there. That's going to be a 7 then, isn't it? So now 7 across this way, 7 across that way. And there is our 7. And that's our first completed digit. Right, again, 6 and 9 here. So in these squares, we're looking for two, four, five. We've got four blocking up there, so that will be the four. And this will be two and five here. Um, so two, yes, that's that fits. Five. Hmm. Okay, this square and this square are not two or. Five. Oh no, we've got that as two. Sorry, take that back. Forget that. Uh, okay, so we have twos like this and there. Okay, we've got four blocking. Let's just do it like this. Four blocking here. There's our four. And the last digit up here is an 8. Uh, we've got 8 blocking down here, so 8 is in one of these two squares. So that will block across and say, you can't be an 8. We've got 8 blocking across here and, and here and there. So only one possibility for an 8 in that column. It must go there. Now 8 across this way, this way and down here. 
there's an 8, then 8 down here and down there, there's our 8. <clears throat> Six blocking across here and here puts the six into that square. The last number for this row is a five. Five blocks this square, so this would be our five and a two, I think it is, finishes. Two across here and there, that puts two at the end. And the missing digit here is six. So 6 up here, and we had 6 and 9 in this square and this square, if you remember. I'll just show you 6 across there. There's our 6, and of course we had 9s across like so. There is our 9. 9 blocking down here puts 9 into this square, 9 across there. There's our 9. Last number here is a 3. 3 blocking that way. There's our 3. 3 up and across and across. There's our 3, and the last digit here, 1 one blocking down and across there there's our one right quite a few finished digits now unlike a moment ago two goes there here, here this is five and <clears throat> over here we're looking for a five as well five blocking this square and this square there is our five five across here puts five there missing number here is two two blocks up here there is our two the last number here eight eight blocking down here there is our eight and six finishes the game so much more straightforward kind of game from the LA Times that's the expert level o puzzle over for a Saturday I'll see you on a lazy Sunday maybe it's lazy maybe I'll have to do some work bye bye